Do this for seven days straight and see what happens. Because if you do this right, I'm telling you, this will change your life. And you'll never look at manifesting the same way again. You see, the problem is that there's a lot of confusion out there when it comes to imagining or visualizing your future. Because I see comments where people are like, I imagine, I visualize, but nothing happened. This stuff doesn't work. All right. But what do you say to those who say it did work for them? Now what? Does it work or not? Which is it? When Neville Goddard says imagining creates reality, he doesn't mean visualizing something you want and boom, it'll show up. But some people think that, right? So here's the thing. If you don't understand how the law of assumption operates and you're doing all these different techniques every day, striving, sucks to say, but you're wasting your stinking time. Understand the mechanics first of why things come into being. Then you'll start seeing results. And so today I'm going to clear things up for you and we'll teach you step by step Neville Goddard's classic method on how to manifest because it definitely works. Put it to the test. You know what I'm saying? If you already know it, let this be a reminder in case you lost focus. Cool? All right, first things first. What you got to understand before trying to change anything is that your life expresses one thing and one thing only, which is this your state of consciousness. Your state of consciousness, as within, so without. In other words, your world and all the conditions of your life are the outpicturing of what's going on inside. And so, if you want to change your outer world, well, then, you got to change your inner world first. That's the order, not the other way around. Now, how the heck do you do that? Thanks for asking. Neville talks about building your new life, your new environment you want to live in. Listen, by preparing a place for yourself. By preparing a place for yourself. And by place, it doesn't necessarily mean a place in space. It could be health, wealth, companionship, anything you want in this world. Here's how to prepare a place. Here are the steps. Ready? First, construct as lifelike a representation as possible of what it would be like if you were physically present and physically moving about in your desired quote-unquote place. In other words, come up with a scene, your ideal scene of what you'd experience. For instance, if you were happily married, or completely healthy, or debt-free, etc., what would you see? What would you hear? What would you do? Next, with your physical body immobilized, you must imagine that you're actually there in that place, seeing and hearing and doing all the things you would see, hear, and do if you were physically there. And keep looping it over and over again. Until when? Until it takes on the tones of reality. So you're not just thinking of your desire. Rather, you're thinking from it. You're thinking from it. You're not just imagining something in your head. But you're actually experiencing it in consciousness. That's the game changer, you guys. Then once it feels natural, guess what? The place has been prepared. You better believe it. Your new reality will manifest. Because where you've been in imagination, get this, there you will be in the body also. How is it going to happen? Don't worry about it. Seriously, don't worry about it. Just know that when you assume a state of consciousness, you'll move automatically across a bridge of incidents, a series of events, leading from where you are physically to where you are consciously, linking the two states together. Is this making sense? So try this for seven days. Give it a shot. Solidifying your imaginal acts. Reason may deny it. Your senses may deny it. But if you remain faithful to it, your old life will pass away. And your new life, your new place will appear. Because you get what you believe. Yeah. Alrighty, guys. Don't forget to smash that like and subscribe button. Help support this channel. And the bell right next to it to be notified of my next video. I pump these out every single week so you don't want to miss them. If you're listening via podcast, I'd really appreciate a review. It gets more people to discover my work. And of course, I've spread this message. And yo, don't forget to register for my free online training that'll seriously help you to start manifesting the life you really want right now. So check it out. At least in the description. Like I always say, more is coming. Till next time, I'm out. Peace.